Democrats and Republicans in Washington are both urging party leaders to get NAFTA passed, uh, get NAFTA's replacement passed, I should say. The uh, United States-Mexico-Canada trade agreement is what we're talking about. But as KCA9's Trevor Shirley reports, there are still some hurdles in getting that done. Both sides of Congress agree it's time to pass the United States-Mexico-Canada trade agreement. They signed it at the end of November last year. And yet for a year now, Congress has refused to take it up. Replacing NAFTA was a pillar of President Trump's campaign. This week, he continued to push for its passage. It's a great deal for everybody, so hopefully they can get it done and get it done fast. Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi said she wants a deal done by the end of the year, but some Republicans say she's the one holding up the process. Speaker Pelosi and her House colleagues have had more than enough time to pass this important agreement, yet they've failed to do so. On Thursday, some House Democrats said a deal is within reach. Now, where are we now? We're actually very close. But some sticking points for Democrats include negotiations over stricter labor standards and removing some legal protections for big tech companies. And so it's critical that we resolve the issues, we move forward like we do in Texas, and we, we uh, come together to do what's good for this country. Some Texas congressional reps say if the deal doesn't happen, everything from agricultural exports to manufacturing jobs could take a hit. That's why we as a Texas delegation were here together to say we want this trade agreement to be done this year. Reporting in Washington, I'm Trevor Shirley.